on the one hand, the document-based question feels like a heck of a lot of work to do because it's all these documents. But when you boil it down, that's what you're trying to do. This right here. So the one thing going on is unnecessary. You don't have to. I mean, they're good to have, and I don't mean to sound like you can just do bullet points and get your way through that. I still want you to structure it in the English language, mm -hmm. and, you know, and that sort of stuff. And the paragraph is the best way to do that and sound articulate and keep yourself cohesive. But what you want to be thinking in your head is, here's my checklist. You know, have I have I hit all the things that I need to hit? Great, good, I'm done. I can move on. That's why the chart is so helpful. Very few people made the chart um, before they started it. But once you have the chart, you have all this information there in front of you, and you're basically just running a spreadsheet and turning it into sentences. 